It's a new day for fatherhood. It is Friday. I just got off the phone with one of my good friends, Rob, and we were just talking about life and fatherhood. And I was telling him about how last night, you know, it was the first night I dropped Brooklyn off to go trick or treat with her own friends. And, you know, just transitions as a dad. And he was talking about how his daughter is a senior and looking at, uh, they, they're going to preview a college tomorrow. And, uh, just like things around that and, and he made this comment to me which I just thought was so good and so true is like our kids all go through stages there's always stages and he said because uh, he's got three in high school you know I got one in eighth grade and and uh, I was like you'll get a kick out of this because your kids already you know are trying to do their own thing and my kids are kind of pushing me now to not do necessarily the normal family tra uh, traditions, but going and want to trick or treat by themselves or whatever. And he's like, Ned, as soon as you have the stage figured out, they moved on to the next stage. So as soon as you have the it figured out of how you deal with a five-year-old, well, now they're seven and there's something new. So it was just funny. It made me laugh. Just this constant change, this constant shift in the kids, I mean, they grow so fast and each stage is so different. You know, once we're, you know, 25, 30, we're in 35, 40, whatever, you're, you're in different stages, but it's different, you know, than a kid who is like pushing the limits on, on wanting to grow up. And, and I know as us adults, we're like, dude, stay a kid. Being a kid is way much, way better than freaking being an adult with all the responsibilities and stuff we have. But I just love that, you know, and it's just so true. So. Uh, rebel against getting stuck in a stage. Rebel against the idea that like it's always going to stay one way and enjoy and create time and space to enjoy each and every stage that your kid is in and just be ready for the next one. Enjoy the one you're in. Maybe look ahead a little bit to prepare yourself for whatever's going to be next.